family needs to, you know, to provide support, uh, that way you have a connection to reality and being healthy. Uh, that was really, really excellent for you to take that initiative. Um, when I was a teenager, I had a friend who had bulimia, basically, throwing up, and I knew about it, nobody else did, and I did the same thing, I talked to an adult, and the person was helped. Uh, so this is, first thing out of the box is you need to identify with them, realize that you can help, and uh, you, can, you can be your friend to them. If they're embarrassed about it, of course they will definitely be embarrassed about it and not want to talk to anybody. But again, just like any other destructive behavior, you want to help, help the people out so that you can actually make something, uh, make something of themselves and get professional help so that they can work it out. All right, let's uh, summarize what we've done here today. Uh, we've talked about body image. What is body image, somebody? Can I give you what's a body image? Um, it's your own. Idea what your body is. There you go. We did the we did the cell phone test. Everybody thought they were pretty good, right in the ballpark. I thought I was, but I was actually a little too much. What is body mass index? Somebody else? Body mass index. Um, it's the like your height and your weight. You calculate that, and it will tell you if you're overweight or underweight. So there you go. It depends on where you are in the ball game. It gives you just a reference point to know. For your particular body size, whether you're underweight, normal weight, overweight, or obese. Okay. Uh, what about different uh, different eating problems like anorexia nervosa? What's that? Anyone? Anorexia nervosa. Yes, yeah, it's a fancy name for starving yourself because you have a poor self-image. You look in the mirror, no matter what you are, you think you're fat, 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 and you're gonna starve yourself. What about bulimia? Matt Russell, what's bulimia? Excellent, excellent. That's exactly right. Uh, and so we've talked about a few of these things. Bottom lines: you have any friends with eating disorders? How can you help, Ben Navarro? Talk to an adult. Okay, talk to an adult. Raise the flag. It's no difference if you have a friend who's an alcoholic or doing drugs and going to kill himself. Go out and raise the flag and. Uh, Man up, as they say, and, and don't worry about anybody kidding you for what you're doing because you're trying to help people. Okay? All right. Well, this uh, concludes our, our Monday class. Uh, the next Leadership Lab 4, which is going to be on September 27th, we're going to be going through the classroom performance system, which is a computerized uh, clicker system. And we'll be actually reviewing all this then and actually having a test on this 10th of September. There is no leadership lab on Labor Day, so that's a free week we have. But your actual test will be via the CPS, the clickers, and that includes this class in here. Uh, and we'll all do it on the September 10th when we actually have a uh, meeting on Chapter 4 here. All right, any questions around the room? Get it, McKee, why don't you dismiss the class, please? Judgment flight. Let's turn. Hut. Dismiss. Go to great days.